Welcome back to the channel. I know you guys remember this one. I just checked on my son's computer. It popped up in his feed. We have 40,000 views on this original Trash Basher colorway. And I saw this in the store the other day. I talked about it on one of my Forza videos and I thought, hey, I need to get it. I need to do a second one. So right off the bat, we have the I'm colorblind and I'm guessing this because it's like a green recycle trash type thing. But this is green, light green to the white, okay? So then when we go to the trailer, it looks like it's flip-flopped. We have the dark color on the dumpster and then we have the, I guess that's the same. I'm not really sure. I think it's the way they, they are and the material they are, you know what I mean? But what's the coolest thing is this. I love how we have the green truck, but in this one, it's that dark color, maybe black, I'm not sure, dark green, and yellow. I know everybody in the comments is going to be like, oh, I'm telling you what color it is. Listen, it is very tough being colorblind, and I'm red-green colorblind, but then I'm also like Dutan, whatever the other one is, a little bit. So just for example, playing Fortnite is a nightmare, and thank God that they have um, the actual settings in there that you can change it, but it's not... It's not really that big a deal because the only things I have trouble with is like the blue and the purple rarity, which isn't much on a gun, you know? And the real problem is the green versus the gold. I sometimes have trouble with them, but you just kind of have to look at the words and such is life, right? All right, let's do a side-by-side -side comparison. All right, I want to know what you guys think in the comments or the like button, whatever. Tell me which one of these you like more. If you like the original, go and like that video, go watch that video for me. It's already at 40,000, so you probably have already seen it. But I think I like the new one, I don't know why. And I don't know why this is yellow. Like that, that doesn't make sense. I'm really trying to look at this. All right, so the front is black, right? And then we have that intercooler again, which I think it looks tougher on the black one. Hot Wheels Waste Management. You're definitely gonna miss this on trash day because it's just gonna fly by. Yeah, let's do that, let's switch them up. See how they look. It's not too bad. It still would fit. I actually like this one with this scheme. I think that's cool. <clears throat> Excuse me. But as we did in the last video, let's go ahead and give it the old... Oh my gosh. It's not pulling a wheelie. Did they fix it? They may have fixed it, guys. I'm not sure. Because look at this. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I can almost get... My entire finger into there, and this one is on the ground. So they may have fixed it. I'm not sure. I'm trying to feel what the difference is. I don't know. It might just be a fluke. It might just be the one I got, but he's just nosed over. You know what I mean? And then we have the dumpster, or the trailer, or both. And it actually has a shiny... A shiny look to it almost like some flake in there you know this is just um i can't tell the levers of course plastic i think that's metal yeah that part's metal i don't know it's a weird thing it's a very hard plastic if it's not if it's not metal i think it's plastic but it's so weird it feels I know this is metal, so maybe this is plastic, because usually with Hot Wheels, they do not splurge and put metal everywhere. Something's plastic and something's metal, you know, but we still have that action where at night, I guess you come by and pick these up, these little garbage haulers, and take them back to the central location or whatever, whatever. 
Where are Fletcher Hook? Why is that not sitting right? Oh no. Now it's all kinds of messed up. I think the other one sits like that too. It's fine. Anyway. I'm not going to go into these as in-depth as I did last time. I just wanted to make a video um, showcasing the new one. The new Super Rig Trash Basher colorway. Let's look on the back. The reason that made me think about it was I'm colorblind. So I saw the C Scenic Root. See that right there with the boat, boat trailer? I saw that on eBay. I was looking for new ones to get for you guys to show off. And I saw the Carnival Steamer, and I'm like, I'm pretty sure I have that. And I was looking around, and I have one of these stunting semis. But I looked at the Trash Basher and just thought, oh, okay, well, maybe it's in the same series. Maybe I just missed it. No, it's a completely different color. And that's just that's just me. That's how God made me, I guess. Um, but I still, don't, I still don't know which one I like better, for real. I think the yellow clashes a little bit too much. I think it looks cool on its own. Like, imagine if that was a Hot Wheel that you could just buy for a dollar. I think they had one similar. I don't know if it's the exact same one, but I know it wasn't in that color. Um, this one looks more realistic. As cartoony as it is with a huge intercooler up front and this thing that can't keep its back wheels down. I think that looks more realistic. But as, as a re-release, as a second one, this darker color, I love it. I wish they had maybe the darker color on the dumpster part or the whatever compactor part of this one. And then we could run yellow up front or the light green. That would be sick. But like I said, please let me know in the comments below um, which one of these you think is better, which one of the tractor trailers or the super rig and which one of the little garbage trucks? I'd really like to know. Because I, I can't really decide. Because I love the original one. It made me want to buy it. I was like, okay. $8, Walmart. Like, actually, I, I said in the other video, um, I looked I looked past it a couple times. I was like, no, no, no. And then I saw that they were getting bought up. Like, I'd come back and the other ones were still there, but not, not the trash bashers. So... When I figured out, my colorblind self figured it out that it was a different one. I was like, okay, I'm definitely going to get this new one. But there she is. I just wanted to showcase it for you guys and uh, let you know they're out there. I picked mine at my local Walmart. I'm sure you can get it on eBay. Um, those are probably the two easiest places to get them. Um, I know Amazon, you know, you might be able to find something like that. But it seems with Hot Wheels stuff individually, you seem to overpay. You have to pay a good bit. Or you can't choose what you want, you know, one of the two. And Facebook Marketplace, I don't know if anybody would have them. And it's just a pain. So I recommend eBay if you can't find it locally. Uh, I don't know if Target has them. We don't have a Target locally. It's kind of like the next town over. But uh, you may find them there as well. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, most of my content is usually Forza Horizon 5 related. They just had a recent expansion with the, uh, the new Hot Wheels Park. It's tons of crazy tracks and loops and there's some like dragons. This It's absolutely crazy. So if you wanna check that out to see if you wanna buy it yourself or maybe you're just curious and you know you wanna be entertained, whatever. Uh, on this same channel I have countless videos recently of me playing Hot Wheels on Forza Horizon 5 as well as Every day I'm posting uh, different challenges that I need to do over there. So, thanks for watching again. I appreciate the views, if nothing else. You guys take care, and I'll see you in the next one. Later.